Hello everyone, welcome back to another YouTube video. I am Blue Bomb, and today we are going to do a VeggieTale Silly Song tier list. Um, I I would call myself a Silly Song connoisseur. I was the child that, if you did not have VeggieTales playing 24-7, I would scream like a banshee. But, today we are going to use that experience for content. So, let's go. Okay, for, so I've... I found this um, template on tiermaker.com. Um, I'll make sure to leave a link down in the description. But we are going to start with the list that they've got here. Um, first one here is uh, Silly Songs with Elves. I believe it's um, A Baby Elf is what it's called. Um, honestly, this song never really clicked with me. Um, it was just, to me, it was just weird. Even, like, when I was a child, even now, just... Here's maybe a little bit funny, but I'm going to honestly put this in D tier. It doesn't quite fail, but it's pretty close. Now, uh, let's go. Let's go ahead and go with a big hitter right here. We got Boys in the Sink Belly Belly Button. I think is the name of it. Um, so this is a pretty good song. Um, maybe even S tier. Yeah, I'll put it in S tier. You know, but VeggieTales, they're singing about belly buttons. Solomon sung about belly buttons in a love song, so why not VeggieTales singing about belly buttons in a love song? So let's continue on with the blues with Larry. Um, this one, it... I feel like it doesn't do that much that's real special. It's got kind of the gag with Larry being real happy, but um, I don't feel like that's really enough to carry the whole thing. So I'm going to put in C tier. I feel like that's a pretty good place. Now, the Song of the Sabu. This one has a, gim a gimmick going for it of the slide projector, um, and he's showing this um, story about this boy and his taboos. Um, I'm going, and like, it's got a really good, it's got some good music, got some funny gags. I'm going to put it in B tier. I wouldn't probably put it in A tier, I'll just put it in B tier for now. Now, Love Songs with Mr. Lunt. Um, I really like this song, uh, Cheeseburger. Is, I believe is the name of it. We're, uh, it definitely goes in A or S. Uh, I think for me, I'm going to go with A. I know lo lots of people love it. It's their favorite song. But for me, it's just not as good as like some of these on in here. Now, next. The Dance of the Cucumber. Um, I this song I like it. Um, it's definitely kind of is a it's got a funny gimmick to it. Let's see, um, as for where I would put it, uh, I'd probably go with B tier. It's funny. It's not as funny as some of them on here. Now, endangered love. This is definitely one of the most unique premises I'd say for a VeggieTales song of a um. Or the, uh, a soap opera about manatees. Uh, I'm going to go with A. No. Uh, I would say B for Barbara Manatee, but I think we're going to have to go A. Yeah, A, A tier. Now, Silly... Let's see, what is this one? The Gated Community. This, honestly, is one of my favorite Silly songs. I know it came a bit later, um, so lots of people may not quite have this nostalgia for it that I have. I, mm, I really like it. I don't think I'm going to put it in S tier, though. Yeah, we'll, we'll put it in A tier. I do think I'm going to have it further ahead than, like, Love Songs with Mr. Lunt and Endangered Dangered Love, though. Uh, I'll put it behind Mr. Lunt. Yeah, there we go. Okay, now, the hairbrush song. I went through and like made sure I listened to all these songs before doing this, just so I wasn't purely going off of like biased memory. And I was thinking when I before I watched it, I was thinking it was really overrated, and people just kind of liked it for just because it was silly and just kind of stuck with them. But honestly, it is really good. I watched it. I was about. I was kind of like with those um, trying out the singing challenges. I was. This is probably one of the closest ones that I was to singing. So. We're going to go with S tier. Even above that, yeah. It is very good. So, now, 
Classy songs with Larry. Um, I I know some people like it. Definitely does well. Okay, it definitely misses some points for not being an original music track. I guess. Yeah, because I mean it reuses like some um, older music. However, I don't think that should completely just put it down in the bottom of tears because. Honestly, I really love the song. I like it a lot. Um, it's got that, I mean, part of it's that music that's already with it. It's just got that catchy beat, and it's kind of a funny premise. Um, so I'm going to put it in, like, high B tier. Now, my jam, The Pirates Who Don't Do Anything, this is, like, my bucket list song. I want to, like, go through and do all the things that they said they didn't do. That's just kind of a personal goal of mine, but aside from that, the song's super fun. Super fun to just jam to, just singing it out loud. Especially if you got, like, friends singing it with you. This will be, like, one of the funnest songs to sing on this list. It definitely goes at, like, top of S tier. It may be the best song um, VeggieTales has ever done, in my opinion. Um, next, Lance the Turtle. So, with Lance the Turtle, I like it. I don't think it's as good as... Definitely not not even close to S tier. Um, and I don't think I would say that I like it as much as Classy Songs with Larry either. Um, I'd say probably B tier. Now, Oh Santa. I don't care what time of the year it is. This Christmas song should get a pass. It's fun. It's silly, it's sweet, and it has one of the funnier adult jokes in VeggieTales. Not dirty jokes, but just adult jokes, the whole IRS thing. You know what, for the IRS thing, I'm going to pop it up in A tier. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do that for now. Now, I love my lips. This is another classic silly song. Um, and it's really fun. I feel like it deserves to be... I, yeah, I'd say it definitely deserves to be an A tier. question is where, though. I think... Mm, I think I might honestly put it... No, I, I'd say behind Cheeseburger. Now, Pizza Angel. One of my absolute favorite songs of VeggieTales. Not to the level of like pirates do, who don't do anything, but definitely up there. Um, question is, like, should I give it S for sauce or A for something else? A for anchovies or S for sauce? Um, I'll give it A for anchovies. Yeah, it goes in front of because pizza is better than cheeseburgers. Deal with it. So, now, the granddaddy of Silly Songs. The first one. Um, it's definitely a fun one. Um, Buff the Water Buffalo song. Definitely a fun one. Would not say it's the best one, for sure. But it is up there. I would say B tier. Um, probably above Lance the Turtle. Maybe behind Classy Songs with Larry. <clears throat> now, another one of my favorites. The Yodeling Veterinarian of the Alps. It's super silly concept. Super fun song. Funny jokes, too. Um, I think... I honestly think I'm going to put this in A tier. Um, yeah, A for Alps. Uh, we'll put it here. Yeah, we'll put it there for now. We'll go over this at the end and review it. Um, let's see. I'm going to go ahead and skip ahead of the list here a little bit. Because some of these, I'm actually like not very familiar with like these three right like these four are ones that i um, didn't really grow up with to be honest um now let's see schoolhouse poker i believe is the name of this not the best silly song but definitely i don't think it deserves to be um definitely not in the bottom two mm. we'll give it a b yeah, we'll give it a B. Funny concept. I really like the um, part where he just breaks down into a rock solo 
or guitar solo on his accordion. Now, let's talk about SUV, Sports Utility Vehicle. This song is weird. I feel like it's too silly for its own good. This is like a song that I didn't get as a, that I didn't really get as a child that well. I'm still kind of, still kind of weird to me now. Um, I feel like it was a song written for adults, but it just isn't good. Like it was written for the parents watching more so than the kids. It's about love. It's about SUVs. It's about being heroes. I feel like it's too, again, I feel like it's too silly for its own good. And every race needs a loser. And that's why we brought you SUV. Now, going on to these right here. <clears throat> the, I believe Monkey, I think Monkey is what it's called, but um, this was like the last, this was a silly song on like the last, or let's see, what would it be? The, this is the silly song from the newest VeggieTales that I like received as a child, if that makes sense. Like, like these four right here. Didn't have the DVDs that these came on, so I didn't really grow up with them. But this one, Land of Hot, I think it's the wonderful Land of Highs. That one I'm more familiar with. So I do have some um, nostalgia, I guess you could say, of it. Um, this was more towards when I was kind of getting out of VeggieTales. So I do believe hmm, it's got a catchy beat. It's got a funny premise. But it's also kind of at the point where I feel like VeggieTales started to go downhill a bit. Um, I'd say B tier. Yeah, like low B tier. Okay, now. Going into these songs here. Um, I have listened to them. Some of them are funny. Some are kind of weird. Um, let's start with the Sippy Cut. I find the Sippy Cut one pretty funny. Um... It's a silly premise, like all silly songs should have, at least to some degree. Um, question is where to put it, though. It's definitely not an S tier. I don't. I wouldn't even say A tier, to be honest. Oh, didn't. Uh, we will put it. Hmm. I kind of. I'm feeling B tier. Um. Yeah. You know, the more I look at the song of the cucumber, I feel like it needs to be a little bit further down. I still don't think mm, you know what? We will put it at high C for cucumber. Alright, so now Sneeze if you have to, I think is the name of this one. Um it's okay, it's kinda average, I'd say. So I'm gonna put it in C. Um, now for obscure Broadway show tunes. Um, I think this is called Staplers, or Where Have All the Staplers Gone? It's, I'd say it has a good presentation. It's got a silly premise. I feel pretty good about get, putting it in B tier. I honestly think it's probably better than the Polka one, Schoolhouse Polka. And maybe even better than Monkey? Yeah. I think I may like the Sippy Cup song better, though. Now, The Biscuit is as Miranda Bow. I think, I think I said that right. Um, oh. It doesn't quite deserve to be there, but I can't seem to move it back down now. I'm going to say B for Biscuit. Now, <clears throat> let's review this list. I feel... I feel very confident in parts that don't do anything. It deserves to be there. I'd say... Yeah, hairbrush can stay there. Uh, boys in the sink, belly button. Yeah, it can stay there. Let's see. Pizza song. Honestly, for me, I'm going to put um, ham cheeseburger down a little bit. I'll still keep it in A tier. Um... Yeah, yeah, I mean, I, honestly, I break out into gated community more than I do cheeseburger, so we will keep that there. I love my lips will stay here for a little bit of nostalgia factor. Let's see, I think I feel pretty good about A tier. 
Uh, let's move on to B tier. Classy songs with Larry, the Water Buffalo song, Lance the Turtle. I feel like Lance the Turtle needs to go down a little bit. Yeah. The okay, Classy songs, Water Buffalo song. You know what? I'm going to put Water Buffalo up above. King of the Buffaloes, the B. Okay, Sabu. Yeah. Um, Sippy Cup. Broadway, yeah. Yeah, guys, I think that's going to do it. I feel, I feel like this is a pretty good description of my opinion. Um, guys, let me know what your opinions are, or what your um, favorite silly songs are down in the comments. Also, make sure to subscribe if you enjoyed this. Um, this is kind of, this may be more of a one-off sort of thing, but um, may, put in the comments what you'd like to see next. I um, wanted to branch out into some other um, content that I can do. Um, if you haven't subscribed, make sure to subscribe and like the video. Also, check me out on Rumble and um, come join the Discord. Um, you can share, we can talk about a whole bunch of different stuff. Um, I usually talk about Dokkan, but this is something that I really wanted to do. Um, yeah, so hope you enjoyed this, guys. Remember, Jesus loves you, and so do I. Have a blue bang beautiful day.